What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Wanted to come on and do a review of the Razer Naga mouse that I've got here. This is the uh, Razer Naga. It's a great gaming mouse. Um, as you can see, lots of buttons all over the place. It's got these 12 buttons on the side here, which work really, really well. They're all mechanical switches, so you really get that, that tactile feedback that you're clicking the button successfully. They're, uh, they're really solid. Really, really enjoy that. Lots of customization on the top up here too with your scroll wheel and the different buttons up here. You can customize that stuff real easy. The mouse fits great in your hand. Um, I've got you know medium hands here, and as you can see, it's real easy for me to kind of cover cover the mouse and get some real good coverage on all the buttons and everything, and still be very very comfortable. So really enjoying the mouse. Uh, I play a lot of Elder Scrolls Online and War Thunder with it, and so I've got all my skills and everything mapped to the buttons on the side, and everything works out real real well. With that, I've also got the uh, Razer Vespula mouse pad, as you can see. I've got mine on the speed side. You can flip it over. Here, I'll show you what that looks like. You can flip it over and see the uh, control side, which is really nice as well. It's just a little bit thicker pattern on it. It helps uh, slow the mouse down. I like it, but I really like the speed side better. Uh, but it's really, really cool on either way. So definitely recommend uh, the mouse and the gaming pad as well. I'm going to go on and do a review separately of the uh, Razer software, the Synapse software that you can put on the computer. That plays a big part into the mouse. Uh, so I'll do another review for that here, but wanted to show you guys the Razer Naga and you know if you guys have questions about it or anything at all Definitely let me know in the comments. Thanks so much